Do you want to know how much money I make each month just by existing? I make... What's going on guys, British Brad here. Welcome back to another video and today I have a very interesting story about a kid who flashed his money in anger and got in trouble doing it. But guys, I do crazy stories like this every single day. So if you do like the stories, do subscribe and like and also please hit that notification bell because it really helps out a lot and I would really appreciate you. So yeah. But anyway guys, I'm quite fond of telling crazy stories and today is certainly no exception. So let's get in to today's video. So this story is based back when I was in school. Yes guys, we've got another school story to add to the collection. Now there were some crazy people in my school, there were some bullies, there were nerds, and then there were people who were just damn right arrogant because they had a lot of money and we didn't. So basically it was split into different sections due to people's backgrounds and stuff. These were the type of kids that you would see getting pulled up in a BMW by their rich father and stuff and they've got like their hair combed back and you know they have a nice suit on. In a school where it's basically just filled with people who are like middle class. So I don't understand why they were in our school but whatever. And the most frustrating thing about these type of kids were when there were teachers around they would be very like polite and you know just trying to be nice. But when they're gone, they treat us like dirt. They're like, ah, oh, uh, I shouldn't have to wait in line behind people who are a lower class than me. And just like proper like arrogant people. There was one kid in particular who took being arrogant to the next level. See, this was the kid who would literally flash his money in any situation. Like, for example... He didn't hand his homework in once and the teacher had to go at him and he said, My father pays your wages. I shouldn't have to hand in my homework if I don't have to. And like proper like and his hair's like wiggling back and forth when he's telling you know as he's saying it. <laughs> and see I didn't really like this kid. He was really, really arrogant and he would never ever associate with people well of my standard, if that makes any sense. One day during a PE lesson, we were playing football. And I kicked the ball and it hit him in the face. Now I'm not going to say I did it on purpose and I'm also not going to say it was an accident. I just kicked the ball and it went in his direction and hit him in the face. Anyway, he's all like up in the air in anger and stuff. He's saying, oh my god, you need to disqualify him. Oh, oh, he needs a detention, a one hour detention for doing that to me. Like, anyway, the PE teacher turns around and goes, look, it was just an accident. You know, I'm, I'm sure he didn't mean it. I said, I, I even said, I said, oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to kick the ball at you. Um, I was just kicking the ball. But no, he's having none of it, he's having none of it. He's saying, why are you, even you should be sacked. You are a bad teacher, you need to be fired. My father, I will get my father to see to you being fired after this day. And you know, the teacher says, well look, look, it's, it was an accident. He said, sorry, let's carry on. He's, and he's like, he's, no, he's having none of it, he's having none of it. He's going, going on about how everyone is below him and he needs to be took to a better school. He should be treated with so much more authority because he's, you know, he's got more money, he's better class. And uh, the PE teacher just turned and said, look, you're all the same in this school. And besides, it's probably not you that makes the money anyway. It's your father that makes the money. So that's that. A kid goes, oh, well, well, it's going to be mine one day anyway when my father eventually gets old and retires. So it's basically my money already. And, he's like, and his head's all like, you know, shaking and stuff. And he just goes, look, if you don't stop, I'm going to give you a detention. And again, the rich kid's going, how dare you to go say you're going to give me a detention? You are nowhere near my standard. I'm, I'm so much better than all of you. And he's proper like going on proper arrogant. You know, he's proper like got a spoon up his ass. And the kid, at this point, he turns and goes, Do you want to know how much money I make each month just by existing? I make one million pounds each month. Anyway, so the teacher gave him a detention, and the kid again is flailing, and he's, you know, and he punched another kid in the nose. And anyway, so he's, he then got it properly escorted off the pitch, and his dad had to come in. Uh, I don't really know what happened between that and that business, but all I know is that um, after that situation, that kid never ever flashed his money again. So I'm assuming he got a pretty bad punishment, I don't know. But um, yeah, I just thought that'd be a pretty funny story to tell you guys about some of the kids I had to put up with in my school. I hope you enjoyed the video, guys. If you did, do smash that like button and leave a subscribe. And also hit that bell because, you know, you're not a real subscriber unless you hit that bell. So why not? Anyway, thanks for watching the video, guys. Hope you guys have a good day. Peace out.